Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you are all doing well today. So today uh, we are, <laughs> and yeah, I just decided to turn the camera on and we are going to do a little bit of organizing uh, because I kind of got uh, way, way distracted and off course, if you will. So as you can hardly see under this mess, I had things out for our um, Valentine journal and was going to do my next video um, working on it. Here it is. And totally, totally, totally got sidetracked. So I'm going to move my new five tier adjustable thingy over here and move that. Let's see. And let's get this stuff. I did. I'll go ahead and show you. I did go ahead and put this down on the inside. Um, and I have uh, the two signatures ready. Everything's in there. Just got to get it in there. Uh, and I made some little ruffles out of these. Uh, a couple of the... Um, yeah, that was time consuming. I'm not good at ruffles at all. So the utmost respect for people who make all these ruffles and put them in their shop. Because... Yeah, that is not something I'm good at. So, let's go ahead. This is already made ephemera. And get this stuff over here. Um, what else do we have? We had this, and we're going to use that so we can put it there. Okay, so I think I got all the Valentine's stuff out of the way. All right, so um, this is different antique papers. Um, a lot of it, that's a scrap, a lot of it from Rachel over at Roxy Creations that I have bought over the last, I don't know, probably almost two years now. Um, so I guess I have opened up different packs and did not organize and or put things back where they belong so then I ended up having okay so this was mine this is French so this is not hers but still in a different language so we'll just pop it there there's a couple more of those um, but yeah I wanted to try to get these more organized and back in one place, if you will. There's another scrap, music sheet, more of the larger papers here. Try to get them kind of in here by size. Yep, that'll work there. Then this can go back here. Yeah, so I just thought I would throw the camera on and bring you guys along with me and this happens a lot where I am working on one thing and then totally totally get sidetracked um, to something else and when we get to it I will show you what I have decided to do and another thing Another thing, if you will, that I decided to do and how I got sidetracked. I like this, guys. Well, this was some kind of bag. But this right here is uh, green and that reddish-looking color um, butcher's paper. Um, I don't even know where to put stuff. Okay. That there. And this is just a scrap. Some more rice paper there. Okay, so see, this one I have already gotten into because it looks like I put scraps back down in here. So, these need to go with the scraps. Get those cleaned out of there. And I'm not even paying attention, guys. I hope I'm on camera enough. Okay, so that bag we can use to... Put some stuff in. Okay. 
Okay, so we'll put that somewhere else. So I would like to keep this pretty much all of the um, book pages. Um, Alright. So I hope you're all doing well and if you have decided to do some organizing beginning of the year it looks like a lot of people are and it seems to be a good time to do so I hope it is going well for you it is slow go for me but we're getting there we will get there okay, let's see. here and then these were from Rachel. Pretty pictures. I love architect like that. Let's see right there. Okay. So this one looks like a completed pack that I probably haven't really used out of. So let me grab oh, some tape here. And we could just take this back down. And try to remember not to open it unless we're out of this other over here that's already open. So these I think I'll put in that tray and leave open. Um, so that's a full one. And this one, that's her thank you note. This one's a full one, so that's good. Those two. And then that one's a full one. I know, guys, I have a problem, okay? I definitely admit it. But in my defense, this is over like two years, so I don't think it's that bad. Okay, so this is my pack of rice paper, and I do think I have um, another set of rice paper coming. Um, I don't know why, because there's a lot here, but anyway. Um, I think it's just because she does. Uh, combine the shipping so this is my basket thing so we will put those there and then those there for the book pages okay now I guess we could use this bag to put those in um what was I saying yeah anyway um So yeah, this is uh, over two years, and I do have some more rice paper coming. And again, I don't know why, because I have that big old stack. But um, she does combine shipping, so the more you buy at one time, as opposed to at separate times, the shipping is... I think I'm tearing this all up. The shipping does end up being less, um, because she combines it, so yeah. So if I see one thing I want, you know, I may buy a couple of other things while I'm there. No, that is just tearing all the way down, I think. The more I push, the more it tears. Okay, so forget it, guys. I do not. <sighs> We're calm. Have the patience for that. Okay. Let's see. I got these small pages back here. Goofball. Go here. They go there? Yeah, they'll go there. Okay, so these maybe we will just find a tray and use this for the tray to use from. How about that? Okay, we could do that. Tape. Alright, what I do wanted to do, however, before I put that away, um... Let's see. Uh, what do I want to do next? See, this is what happens. I get to where I don't know where to go or what to do. Okay. Basket. Get these out from under the basket. Now, again, no judgment, guys. Uh, I seem to have a problem with... Um, yeah, Florentine paper packs as well. 
Okay, so these are from Rachel, but this one right here is from, uh, I have no idea what that says. Anyway, it's another shop on Etsy. This is from Rachel, one of the packs. A small pack. And this is a pack. And, well, it's Christmassy, doesn't it? There's a pack. Okay. So, I try to pick out the ones that are from Rachel. This was from someone else. Um, it's just vintage book pages, I believe. Okay, this one was from Rachel. Looks like I've been in that one. Let's give it a little piece of tape. Oh, hello. Okay. There. Oh, look. Who knew? Book pages. Oh, surprise, surprise. Okay, get under there. Okay, Florentine pack. Quarantine pack and quarantine pack and this was from a different shop. I believe this was a live sale. Okay, this is from Rachel. This is the Christmas pack this year, I think. Oh, and look, another. Okay, that book page. That one could go there. Okay. So that will add to that. Alright. So these I will put on top here in the basket of the book pages. Turn that around so it'll sit a little bit better. Okay, so then I have this one. And then I have these. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure. It may have been. I don't know if this was the shop name or what. If you guys can see that. Uh, on Etsy. Where I got these from. And I think it was. Um, she has really good deals on these too, by the way. Um, and I think if you get so much, maybe you can get free shipping. Please don't quote me on that. Um, you know, but it may be because I do like to, if I'm buying something and they offer free shipping to, um, go ahead and take advantage of that and get a few extra things. Okay, so those can go on the top of there. Okay, so that basket's full, so thank goodness. I think that's all we need to put in it. So I got these out because I'm working on something and I will go ahead and show you guys that real quick because I want to pick out some of these bigger papers to go in here. So, alright, let me show you. I told you I got completely sidetracked and have a mess here, but... We'll be okay. Maybe. Okay. So, this right here, guys. Is a journal. Here we go. Yeah, very messy, right? Is a journal that I bought from Rachel over at Roxy Creations. It is a naked journal. Um, and that's what I liked about it. So, you could do your own thing. So, I had previously thought... I printed out one of her latest kits that I that I got, um, and I thought about using it in it. I have since decided to do something else, and this is the sidetrack. Isn't that just beautiful? She just has a cluster there. There's a little bit of slow stitching there. Very pretty. I love how she puts her things together. Hold on just a second, guys. Okay, sorry about that. Still fighting this cough. So, um... This didn't come with it. 
but um, so she sent me these and this is some antique and vintage ephemera in that gorgeous I'm not going to take them out. We'll look at that another time. But she sent me those. And I think she may have these packs in her uh, shop. But guys, she sent this to me for free. As a little gift. Um, for buying the journal. That was amazing. So we have a pocket here. And look, this is made by Rachel. 2021. Um, I'm going to put this on here somewhere. I'm not sure where. Because she's the one that put it together. So maybe we'll put her here on the front, right? And that's in her handwriting. I really love that. And then in the back somewhere, I'll stamp, um, put my stamp on it. So how about that? So look, she has painted on that. It's really pretty. Um, and then just some scraps here. Isn't it crazy, guys, to watch somebody on YouTube and then actually hold their things? Look, she painted on that and that. See, I haven't even paid attention. I love those. Ugh, thank you, Rachel. Yep. Oh, there's a note, too. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoy your art journal. Best wishes, Rachel. Okay. So, we're going to have to have that in there where it just pulls out. I'm sorry, guys. All right, guys. I do apologize again. So, not only is my throat agitated, I'm still battling this cough. I am on... Anybody could something for cough did not get a steroid this time, so Yep, hopefully All right, so we'll stick that down in there and it also came with um, This stuff in there Cute this is a book spine Cover look at that love it Wow absolutely love things like this so we will stick them back down in there and no doubt use them in here somewhere oh look there's another piece of oh there's lots more things in here gosh Lori pay attention okay some more book page there is there anything else hiding in there if there is it'll be a surprise for later right okay so there's that we'll use those um, I'm not sure if these came from her or not, or if I just put these in here. Um, that says London, May 19th, 1913. Okay, anyway, we may use those. Um, yeah, so what I've decided to do, guys, is I'm going to do the, um, junk journal and I was in the process of cutting some stuff out and trying to pull some stuff for it. And I'm like, um, let me go get my friends. So, anyway, Junk Journal, Junk Journal January. Uh, and it's uh, created and hosted by uh, Meg Journals. Uh, Rachel is doing it. So, I went over there and <coughs> I have decided that for my art journal, um, that's what I'm going to do in it, is that... Um, so yeah, but what I'm wanting to do is like two signatures is put a signature. <coughs> sorry. Okay, guys, sorry about that. I had to take a bit of a break. Um, so yeah, so what I'm thinking about doing is actually putting another signature in here um, with some of these papers and some more rice paper just to uh, have more pages, I guess. Um and I think it's really funny and I love it guys because look this one is in there upside down and I absolutely love that because that just shows we're all human because <laughs> I do that all the time and I have to unbind it and redo it um, but I actually I absolutely love that and this one is too but again I love it love it made me so happy when I saw that so thank you Rachel um, but yeah and so is that one so I guess I have the book the right way. Yeah, because if not, even more pages would be upside down. Yeah, I got it right. Okay, I guess we could tell by this, right? Um, so, yeah, so that's what I want to do. Um, should we go ahead and grab some real quick um, out of this? So, I know I want more rice paper. 
so let's see. Let's do it yet. Let's see. Let's move this out of the way. Maybe right there. And yeah, and perhaps a piece of this. Maybe going on up to the top like that, and let's see what else we have in here. Let's go with a piece of this, and I have two pieces here. Oh, let's just do it that way. Yeah, I think we should do it that way. Yep, yep, so far so good. And let's do how about we do a piece of this ledger here? How do we want to do it though? Um do we want to tear it at the bottom and have it go from the top all the way to the bottom? about right there between the one and the five. Okay, terror. Somewhere in this hot mess. I actually put it back where it went. Surprise, surprise. Okay, so right here. go in there. I don't think it's sticking out too far because it doesn't go over the book, I don't think. Let's see. It's going to go here. Yep, that's going to be perfectly fine. Perfectly, perfectly fine. Okay. So now, let's see. I have this tissue paper. Tissue paper be good in there. Okay. Well, I think I know what I want to do with this. So let's we can put it in there this way. So I'm going to cut it down here. Not that I could cut straight, but you know. We will try and then maybe cut across here. Put it in that way. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I may sew around that as well. So let's get. Let's put that in there. Somehow, like that. Okay. Like in that, like in that. Alright, so maybe we can do piece of that. Some music sheet. A couple of different music sheets. And I love this paper. Oh my gosh. Do I love this paper. Oh look. And that's like perfect too. Do I want this? Oh no. Yeah that's that paper sheet. Oh shucks. She's always saying uh it's never been read because it's still together up here at the top. I don't know how that happens. Let's 
so you know what we're going to use this because I kind of like this and we will put washi down through there on the back and front how about that okay it's too far over there so we need to cut that down and instead of cutting I will tear it so let's get the uh, what did I do with it? Tear roller back out. Here it is. Let's just go about right there, I think. Keep that, because we can stamp on that or paint on that and actually use it in here. It's where this is like, uh, she did call it an art journal, so. Oh, yeah, that works good now. Okay. So we have that there, and you can still see this sticking out over there. We have that, and then that. I feel like I want something here. So let's go with this here. Um, and for giggles, let's... I like to giggle. Oh, we have this that we need to use. Is this a whole sheet? It is. Okay. So let's do this in between here. Like that. Make sure it's not going to stick out too far. Nope, we're still good. Okay, what was I going to do? I was going to put something here or here. Where was I going to put something, guys? I think here. And I'm thinking about a little piece of... Okay, let's stick this here. Then here, I'm thinking about a smaller piece of rice paper. We want to do it like that. I think I will I'll center it. So I think we'll do it like that. that in there okay so let's see so we have one two three four five six let's do it that way six seven look at that Eight, nine, nine, nine pages. All right, so we may have to cut this down at the top. Um, Let's kind of break that up a little bit. Um, I still feel like it needs something else. Where were those like magazine pages? There's a magazine page. Let's do that one. Um, no, we'll do it in the middle. All right. Uh, 
No, you haven't had breakfast. Go, I'm filming. Huh? I'm filming. Please go and sit down, baby. Sorry, that was very on popping his head in. Okay. Let's see here. What we want to do, bring that more toward the top. Just put that one there. Yeah, I think we're going to have to cut that one a little bit at the top. Yep, let's go ahead and do that before we get too far into this. Um, and I know this has turned into less organizing and more uh, getting this ready, but it's the way to get these off of my desk. And I wanted to use some of those papers before I put it away. Okay, that's better. Now, why don't we... Take this one and fold it in like so. This one even more. And this one. Okay. Was like, which way is it going? Okay. All right, that may do there. So, um, did I want to turn this one in? Yep. Turn that one in. All right. So there we go. So we will wash you that, and then we will get this in there somehow with a removable um, binding or whatever it is you want to call that there. So that's that. Um, so yeah, this is the Junk Journal July. So I actually printed these out, so I'm thinking about cutting that and putting Junk Journal and then cutting July down and doing July. And then, of course, I have my prompts, and I've lost one. Where's the other prompt? There's another page of prompts. Golly, Lori. See, this is why I need to be organized. Well, I don't know that organization will help this. So, it is here somewhere. And I got out this piece of fabric because it kind of reminded me of... Quarantine paper. Do you guys agree? So I got that out and I kept these little cutoffs where I cut this up. Okay, I still need to find the other set of prompts. I really don't want to have to. Um, print that out again. Just for the one set of prompts. So hopefully it is here somewhere. In this mess that I have. Oh, there it is. Look at there. Okay. So, I'm going to stick a little paper clip on here because, you know, a hot mess here. I'll just paper clip it to there. How about that? That should keep it together. There we go. So, we have that ready whenever I'm ready to start on that. Okay, so that little piece of fabric. I also got out um, these papers here that we painted on. 
a few videos ago. I don't know how many videos ago, so I'm going to lay those in there because we're going to use those. Um, I think that's going to be a hoard and not a use. Probably use those in here. Oh, there's some more. Look at that. Wow, that is... Yeah, I'm not going to try to say it. <laughs> We're just going to let it go. Let it go. Okay. Probably use those up there as well. Okay. Alright. I think we got that. And then I got these out to use in here. Because they're all different kind. And they're small strips. Which is what I want. So. I guess you could say we organized that, right? So we've got that organized. Sorry guys, I'm going to get an old fashioned lemon sanded drop. Maybe that'll help with this cough. Alright, so that got that. So, let's go ahead and just get this back. Tied up here so that we have it ready. Okay, so this now is on the project tray. So organized. Okay, so these I'm going to call these scraps. So I think we're going to paint on those to actually go in here. I have no idea what that is. But these are all scraps as well. So those shall go right here in this hot mess of a scrap basket for the time being. And I guess we could just put this with this. We'll be okay. Okay, so, this stack, sorry, because I know you guys could tell I've got something in my mouth, but, alright, so here's our basket, so let's do, under the Florentine, this small pack, And then we'll do those. And then we will do these loose ones on the top. So that's one I'll pull from. So, there we go. We got that done. Alright guys, we're already at like 38 minutes. So we are going to call it a video. At least when I sit this back over there where it was, the desk will be clean. Which is good. So I'm very excited about that. And then I will probably go ahead and pull out the rest of the stuff again for my Valentine journal. And do that. Um, not sure when we'll start the, um, oh, that's sour. Yummy, but sour. Um, when we'll start the junk journal January. Um, I will probably film one today because I have to tell you I'm really excited. When I get excited is when I get sidetracked. All right, thank you guys so much for your support. I love you guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.